Hi, I just got this Bible in the mail right now, uh, literally a couple minutes ago, and I thought I would quickly share with you as I'm wanting to give this away um, very soon to somebody special. So I'll just flip through it with you. Uh, the New Believer's Bible. It's just the New Testament. It's from Greg Laurie. This was sent to me. Just going to give you a quick peek of what it looks like inside. The color is so beautiful. Okay, this is the New Living Testament done by Tyndale House Publishers. And it's printed in the United States of America, which is great. So then it gives you charts and indexes. Just let you screenshot that if you'd like. Sorry, I'm standing here holding my phone. So I'll just flip through what it says the main features are. And I have a new puppy, so you're going to hear the puppy in the background, possibly. Okay, so now I'll just flip through near the back. There we go. You can read that. And again, it's really pretty. There's some line paper. Oops, sorry line paper at the back, quite a few pages. There's a topical index, glossary of Christian terms, prophecies about Jesus, memory verses. There's a reading plan in here. This is pretty amazing. How to study the Bible. And then it looks like you're getting also some information on the books. Right. And then it looks like it gives you um, some different passages to read to help understand. Oh, my puppy's starting to whine, so I gotta make this a bit quicker. So, this is just the New Testament. And the person I'm giving it to has been wanting to read the Bible, but they always feel that they need to read right at Genesis because um, they want to know everything, but at the same time, they really want to know about Jesus. Um, but I think some people get really stuck into... Um, oh, my dogs are getting into it. Um, they need to hear the gospel um, and know about Jesus, but I think a lot of us feel we need to start at the very beginning. I don't know if that makes sense <laughs> for some people. Now this isn't red letter. The font size looks to be maybe a seven or eight. Again, I just got this. I don't know too much about it. There's a lot of little uh, good articles, some cute articles. So yeah, this is pretty cool. But yeah, no red lettering. But you have a lot of cool resources. Yeah. So there you can hear my puppy in the background. So that's what this New Believers Bible looks like. And it's not very pricey. So um, yeah, I would suggest getting it. This is going to be going to a teen. So I'm going to be filling this out and giving it to her now. All right, everyone, have a great day, and go check out this New Believer's Bible.